Hey, what's going on guys? What's up? Welcome to another EDC update. Uh, EDC stands for Everyday Carry, and the, the focus of the items we carry everyday, day-to-day -day basis in our pockets with aspect on preparedness, uh, when we carry flashlights and stuff like that. So it's preparedness in mind and uh, just not to be a sheep if something happens or if you need to cut something unscrew something whatnot and for all of you who know what's edc uh welcome back to another edc update in today's video it's uh, january uh and this will be january update holidays are after us so yeah i have some candies here and uh you can have some props hope you can appreciate give me a thumbs up for the props and uh this month i decided to do my very own first orange edc and this is my take for orange edc uh i always wanted to have an orange edc and this is just a start i will add more orange and copper looking things into my edc but this is i could not wait to add them all and it's a journey and it's a trip uh, and I uh, just wanted to get this take and today I've been carrying some other stuff on my EDC that are not orange like my wallet, uh, two-fold wallet, uh, awesome wallet and uh, in my wallet here in the coin slot I have this mini telescopic uh, ballpoint pen and uh, ever since I got it I never had the opportunity to use it <laughs> But I know the first time I don't have pen with me, I'm gonna need one. So yeah, I have pen. Also, I have some other blades in rotation, which I'm not gonna talk about it, but it's just a parrot tree I got for my birthday. So thank you very much. Uh, and uh, gloves because it's winter and I enjoy good weather gloves uh, on a winter day. The, they're kind of cool and i love them i love them so also the non-orange things is my keys and uh my keys i have a phoenix flashlight i think everyone should have a some sort of flashlight on keys uh recently i changed the battery inside the triple a battery but i love how it shows where uh this flashlight it's just how shows how it shows where on the on my keys and it's uh, just a simple on and off triple a battery for no nonsense very good quality and i can unhook it whenever i whenever i need to here i have ready flashlight and i love these phoenix i can recommend them uh very much uh also i had a found my old project pen here mini big pen uh inside and uh you can see I have a mini big pan, which is very handy. And some people suggested I just cut off the, it was a full size mini big pan. And I just cut off it here and uh, used the cap and put it back in and closed it. And uh, it works great. Uh, another thing I added to my keys as this here, I got this from Banggood. You saw the unboxing video, uh, but this is a mini a loop magnifier and uh, I always wanted to have this. I had a couple of these, but I, somehow I lost them. And this one I decided to put on my keys because uh, I have, a, whenever I leave the home, I have my keys with me and I need this. Sometimes I will buy a watch. Uh, you know me, I'm the watch guy. I like, I like even coins, old coins and old watches and everything else. So I use this to make sure the dial is correct and uh, it's not being messed up and the con over to inspect the overall condition and sometimes you can even uh, make out the marking so this is very cheap this is like under under five bucks you can get it i got this from banggood but I, I suspect you can get it all over the place and also with the focus on ed same preparedness uh, it has a magnifying glass in it so arguably a uh, few find yourself stranded on a desert island or somewhere else uh, you can use the magnifying glass to create fire start a fire so yeah that's it besides that I just got keys always strive that my keychain uh, is small but I like having gadgets inside here uh, 
and uh, yeah that's it so keys are on the side no more making noise and uh, over here another non-orange but kind of brown and it fits in these are my sunglasses uh, even though it's winter there's a lot of sunny periods and when the snow gets down especially when you're driving you need uh, sunglasses and uh, these are my bursals and they're kind of brownish but they can blend in uh, with the team and uh, also I can add uh, brown boots uh, here I have a leather pouch uh, this is really nice leather pouch I will store a watch or anything nice that's worth storing in it and uh, uh, next I have my EDC this is uh, Victorinox Cadet and this is my blade when someone asks me uh, you have a knife because they know I do uh, and in the public spaces and whatnot I pull out these because it's non-threatening and uh, I took this loop from a cheapo pocket watch uh, you, the one you can buy on eBay for like I don't know five bucks Chinese one but I like this uh, here chain and I use this one for something else and I hook it on my jeans uh, so I have a nice cool chain dangling and that way I won't lose it because this was also a gift from Laura and uh, yeah I cherish all my gifts and uh, here I have a flashlight this is a Zam flare uh, people have been asking me uh, let me just see here you can see uh, I got this from Gearbest or somewhere along that way. I'm not sure are, are they being produced, but it's made of brass. And uh, it's really, really cool. It has a cool battery inside, uh, which you need to... Uh, you need, you can, Every month or so, just because I don't want to run out of battery, I have here a little USB charger. And I refill, I recharge that battery. Uh, it never ran out of me, but uh, just in case I want to be prepared and I want to have it. So, yeah, I have it here. This wheel is M4. It's uh, like a bullet. I love it. And uh, here, uh, I just added this because it's orange color, but this is a st strap uh, remover. You have a watch and you remove straps for this this is a strap removing tool but it's in my edc because it has this scale so i want to check out the width of something uh, usually it's watches because i like watches i'm a watch guy so a lug width or something like that i can use that and uh, here i have another edc item that i'm not carrying all that much because it's so it's a tiny one you can see my little pinky finger and you can see it here it's tiny but I love it and I'm afraid I'm gonna lose it but I'm uh, this is a case mini trapper which is focus here and uh, it's just uh, one of the nicest made uh, blades I have uh, in terms of fit and finish quality and uh, uh, it's just not that big but I love it and I do plan in the future to get uh, get a case just like this but a bit bigger because I like the craftsmanship and finish and uh, this is a uh, double blade it has another blade uh, I forgot what this is name one but this are mini trapper series I just call it, it has a uh, brass bolsters and uh, overall uh, high finished steel uh, sharp uh, it may be small but it's one of the sharpest and wickedest knives I have and it's really a nice little gentleman's knife I put this in my fifth pocket of jeans uh, alongside with my um, flashlight and I do have some capabilities and some non-threatening blade as well uh, I had to buy an orange. I had to buy an orange lighter uh, for for my orange EDC. I couldn't find a mini big lighter or big lighter that's orange. Uh, they were always kind of pale orange, so I settled for Cricut. Uh, I love it. It's an electric one and uh, just works, and I love it. Orange becoming one of my favorite colors already here. Uh, speaking of orange favorite colors, you can see how this combo 
Uh, that's why I got this here. This is a Spider Co Dragonfly 2, I believe. And uh, got this as a gift to match my, say, Orange Monster. Uh, how cool is this? Uh, how cool are you guys? So I got this to match my Seiko Orange Monster and this is one epic uh, blade. I gotta keep this magnet from the watch. This is one epic blade here. I always glance at it but uh, the one thing that most impressed me about this blade it's not the sharpness. I know the spiders are super sharp but the looks of it ergonomic um, how it fits in my hand perfectly ergonomy as on spot but the one thing i really am surprised are these scales uh, these are frn scales i believe and uh, even on delicas i was kind of i like spider delica but always kind of skeptic about the scale so now that i got one i think these are superb and sorry guys i was interrupted by funko uh, but yeah, I'm not sure which one, which one is, uh, which one uh, is nicer, this one or a G10. I'm kind of a G10 guy, but uh, I love it. I love this here, little spider co. You can see we G10 steel, and it's a really, it's a cutter, and it's made in Seki City, Japan, and uh, this watch is also Japanese icon and. Uh, if you're a watch guy, if you're another watch guy, this is a Seiko Orange Monster, and uh, this is a first generation. They're kind of rare, uh, and uh, I have it here on this black needle with orange stripe. I think it just works great with this watch. Uh, and even if you don't have an orange faced watch, uh, you can add this needle. These are like 10 20 bucks uh, needle bands, and you can add them to your black face watch or other face watch and it will give that little vibe and it will make it pop. This is just a great, great watch. Uh, I'm not wearing it that much because I'm waiting for summer and uh, you will yet to see a review. I will do a review, I promise. Uh, and uh, it's just a fantastic piece and it's made in Japan, Seiko, Cult and uh, Seki City, Japan, Spyderco a famous uh, American breed and I think this is just match made in heaven especially because they are both made in Japan so yeah uh, we'll just move on to the next uh, I have an orange this is just a prop uh, yeah but I think uh, so far this is my take uh, on uh, orange EDC so uh, thank you for watching guys and next time in next video I do this every I do this every month or at least I try to I, as long as you keep watching I'm gonna wa make it and uh, every month uh, next month I will try to uh, upgrade my orange EDC if I don't uh, there will be something but uh, generally this is exception most of the time I just uh, do what I truly am uh, carrying in my pockets and half of these things i'm carrying in my pockets uh and even the jingle balls and jingle bells and uh the other things i just added because i was so excited about making uh orange edc so uh thank you for watching once more i'm edc connor um, don't forget to like this video subscribe share and uh, check the links in the description box it truly helps